Good morning, bro chicas. I am starting a new vlog today. Um, I really don't know when I'm going to upload it though, because it just feels weird to upload content during this time. We are going through some hard times right now and it's, you know, it's it doesn't feel good. It's depressing, it's sad, um, it's awful. Um, and, you know, if I do upload, if I do choose to upload, I will be mentioning this every single time to bring awareness. Um, and I will be leaving the links for the petitions that you can sign, justice for George Floyd, justice for Breonna Taylor, and um, I think it's the change of color petition. And yeah, I have the links below in the description box, so definitely check that so that you can be a part of this movement. It is important for us to speak up and stand with Black Lives right now. So I, I it's, it's tough, guys, because I do want to make content. I do want to vlog for you guys because as much as we need to do what we need to do for this movement, we also need some distraction for like... Our mental health like we also need to still live our lives like we still have to go to work we still have to be good people and happy people for our family like uh, I, I need to be in a happy mood for my children and so I could be a good mother so I am focusing on this and I'm doing as much as I can in my own time um, but I also wanted to vlog and just kind of do more positive things on here if you needed a distraction from the day as well. So, um, yeah, it, it's hard to move on from that subject, but I hope you guys understand what I mean, you know? So yesterday we went to a few stores. Um, hubby had the day off and so did I, and we're just, you know, bored, uh, st sitting around the house and just kind of sad and mopey and we just needed to do something. So we got up and... We put another coat of paint on the garage floor so that's coming along nicely and then we were on the search for like a top coat to put on it to make it more like glossy so we went to Home Depot and we got one of those um, and he put one coat on and then we decided we would love to do like a foamy floor for the gym side of the garage so it could really feel like a gym. So we priced that out at Academy. It's kind of expensive. So we're gonna try to look other places first before we purchase it to do it like more affordable. And we also went to Walmart because we thought maybe they would have them there, but they were sold out. So if we do order from Walmart, we'd have to order online, but they do have those like foam, it looks like puzzle pieces that goes on the floor. Um, but while we were there, we just we just shopped around. We looked around, see what we could see. Um, Mila needed some more summer comfy shorts. She only has like jeans and they were getting a little bit small on her. So we got her some comfy shorts, like play clothes for the kids, you know. We got Austin some play clothes too. And um, another pair of his swim trunks because he only has one swimsuit and everybody else has a couple of swimsuits. And since we use our pool so often, sometimes we haven't ran the laundry from the last time. So I wanted to get him a new pair of swimming trunks. And I got a couple things and hubby got a couple things as well. He found some shorts. I found another pair of shorts. So I wanted to show you guys real quick, like a mini Walmart clothing haul. Got uh, those linen blend shorts in the white color with the black lines uh, from Walmart in my Walmart haul from the brand Time and True. So I found the black ones and I was so excited. I think they were the last ones left because they were just on a rack by themselves and I didn't see them anywhere else because I kind of wanted to get the colorful ones as well. Why is this lighting so bad? But I love these black ones so much with the white lines and they're gonna match everything. And you know, these shorts are just so comfortable, guys. I highly recommend them if you find them. They have them in a bunch of different colors. And I love the white and the black and the black and the white because it's so versatile. You're gonna be able to match it with so many different tops. And again, if you guys missed that video, um, I wear the size large and these are $9.96 and it's the TT Linen Short. So Time and True Linen Short. 
relaxed fit. This one, this size fits me perfectly. It's a relaxed fit. It's uh, it's a longer inseam, so you don't get chub rub with them if you have thick thighs. And it is high waisted, and they are super comfortable and breathable, guys. So I highly recommend these shorts. I'm really glad I found a second pair. And also, I highly recommend these tank tops. I did get a black tank top. If you didn't see that Walmart um, fashion haul. I got a black one of these and they are only $2.88, I believe. It doesn't say the price here, but I'm pretty sure it's uh, $2.88, no more than $3. And they have them in bunches of colors. They have neon colors and bright colors, but then they also have more of like uh, nude uh, natural colors. So I have it in black, like I said, and I decided to get a couple more because they're honestly really comfortable and oh, they just feel so soft and they're so stretchy. It's got a ribbed texture and I just just like for $2.88, this is a really nice tank top for summer that can go under the white lace kimono that I bought. And just with these comfy shorts, I mean, it's just perfect for summertime. So I had to pick up two more. I got this like rusty orange color, which I think will look very nice with these shorts. And I also picked up this tan nude beige color. This color is going to go fast, you guys. This color is very popular. Um, so definitely pick this up if you see it. I get mine in the size large just because I like it to be more fitted. And these can also look like a bodysuit. So if you tuck this into your shorts or your pants, um, it kind of looks like a bodysuit. So I do like to get the large instead of the extra large because you cannot ad adjust these straps. So just a little FYI it's almost like a square neck but it's not really a square neck these are just so soft and so comfortable and I loved these like nude colors so I picked those up and yeah so I'm about to get a shower and start getting ready for my day I do have work today and um, I feel a little bit better about it today like I feel okay like I can conquer the day so that's good because last week I had a hard time and yeah, that's really all I have planned. So I probably won't even vlog again or add to this vlog until tomorrow because I do have tomorrow off. Good morning, bro chicas. It is Thursday. It's my day off. I have a lot of days off, so I don't know why I say it like that, but this is my in-between day since I only work two days a week. Um, it's Wednesday. And Friday so I'm just in between my work days and we actually have to go meet somebody from the committee of our like development or something our little community because they're gonna give up give us our welcome package and all that stuff so they didn't know that we bought a house here they didn't get notified about it so they didn't give us the whole welcome package thing <laughs> that they usually do when people come to the communities so we're gonna go do that today I decided to get dressed and cute. So I'll show you guys my outfit. I just did like a very glowy natural makeup, kind of natural makeup. And then I just put my hair in a bun, a low bun because it's wet. I just showered and I washed it and I didn't feel like styling it with the straightener or heat tools. Like I try not to use heat tools too much. I gave this a little bit of a trim because like the ends were so dead and then I gently with super low heat went over it with a straightener so it could just be uh, smoothed out. But here is my outfit today. I'm wearing my kimono that I got from Walmart and oh actually this whole outfit is Walmart. Oh my goodness, that's so cool. So I this is the shirt I just showed you guys yesterday that I bought from Walmart. It's like $2.88. This color is like a rust orange. It's so cute. I love the color. And these are my comfy black shorts from the athletic section of Walmart. I think it's by Athletic Works. And I'm wearing these flats, which are from Forever 21. I got them a while ago when they were doing that crazy $1 to $5 sale. So these shoes were $3. And the color matches like perfectly with this. It's a very burnt orange. So the only thing is I haven't, so I bought them like months and months and months ago and I've still never worn them. And I was like, okay, well this matches. So I'm determined to wear them. But honestly, like they feel tight up here, even though I put it on the loosest one, but I'm determined to wear them today anyways, so that I can like break them in. Cause I'm sure they just need to be broken in and then they'll be more comfortable. 
um, but yeah, it's not like we're going to like walk around. So I'm going to wear them and then I'm just wearing a bunch of necklaces. These are from Forever 21. They're just little chokers. And then this one is actually so old and you guys have probably seen this before. It's actually from Juicy Couture from like forever ago. I think I was like 16. And then the little gold hoop earrings uh, that I got in that three pack from Walmart by the brand Time and True. And that is my outfit and I feel cute, but casual. I feel earthy, I feel, what do you call it? boho and I love it. I love this boho feel I got going right now. It's really cute. So, and it's very comfortable and it hides my little back rolls. You guys, my back rolls have been annoying me so much and it's not even like I have to look at them because they're behind me, but I think it's like uncomfortable. So I am waiting on an order or a shipment. I actually ordered bathing suits from Shein, but I only got two and they're they're like bathing suits that I'm gonna use to tan in my backyard. So they're not bathing suits that I would actually wear in front of people. I don't think so, I haven't tried them on yet. So I still need to get another bathing suit that I feel comfortable wearing in front of people. Cause even though I love my body and I'm comfortable with my body, I'm not exactly comfortable with showing everything around people. So I'm still on the hunt for like a modest bathing suit, but I did get some two really skimpy little tiny, tiny bathing suits that were cheap from Shein, just so that I have less like tan lines. So that's basically what I got them for, but I will show you guys in a vlog and I will put myself out there and I'll show you my body cause I don't really care to show you guys for some reason. But like if I go to a pool with a bunch of people, I care. I don't know, I think I've gotten way too comfortable on this camera, <laughs> but so I ordered two bathing suits, but I also ordered bra extenders because, you know, obviously I've gained weight. Like we've already talked about this. Well, my back got wider and so my bras just don't really fit right. I don't really want to buy new ones yet. Um, so I just got bra extenders because I think the cups are fine. I think it's just not, I think it's just too tight on my back. So I got those little bra extenders and hopefully that will help my back bulge not be so bad because like, my back fat is normal until I put a bra on. And then when I put a bra on, it looks 10 times worse than it did without the bra. And it's so frustrating. And I'm not gonna tape up my boobs every single day, but I think for like nice occasions or certain days, I don't mind taping up my boobs with the high O boob tape. Cause that honestly looks the best and it helps my back fat not bulge out. But when I wear a regular bra, it just bulges out. Ugh, it's so annoying. Um, so that's why most of the time I wear sports bras. But with this, you can't really wear a sports bra because it's a little thing. I don't know. Maybe I, I need to find a bralette. So the bralette that I bought from Walmart in my last fashion haul, I thought I was going to like it, but it's actually really uncomfortable and it's actually not big enough for my boobs. So maybe I should go back and get a nude one. I think I got an XXL and maybe I need to get a triple XL to fit these boobies. Also, it's by No Boundaries, so they run small too. But also my boobs are very big, so yeah. I gotta, fi I gotta figure something out because like wearing real bras is just not it. It's not it anymore. We don't wanna wear real bras anymore. But I do need like a smaller strap of like, you know, a comfy bra if I'm gonna wear it with this or like lace bralette so when it shows it looks cute. So today I'm wearing a real bra and I feel like I'm being strangled, but we gotta do what we gotta do. Okay, we might get in the pool later, so I probably won't be in this outfit for very long. I just wanted to be cute today. I was just feeling it. Gonna get the wear out of these clothes that I've bought. But yeah, I need to go eat some food. I haven't eaten yet. I really haven't done anything productive today. Um, I worked out for 30 minutes and it's hot as heck. It's so humid. So that was a struggle, but. Other than that, I haven't really done anything. I got to do dishes like <laughs> you guys. It's embarrassing how bad the dishes are right now. And I'm going to show you because I'm real, real like that. Dun, dun, dun. This is terrible. All right, you guys, I couldn't do it anymore. Like, oh, it was annoying me so much to wear that bra. I put the boob tape on again. I just feel like so much better with it. I don't know. I'm running out though. So I try not to use so much. I need to get some more. 
I just feel like it's gonna be my summer thing like okay I will say it kind of sucks to take it off um, taking it off in the shower is better uh, it says in the directions that you should take it off with water so it does help in the shower if you rip it off without water it kind of hurts I ain't gonna lie to you but you know what it feels so free to not have bra straps I even tried a strapless like little bandeau and it was like cutting into my fat and that's the thing that's so frustrating is like do I mind that I'm chunky no do I mind that I'm curvy no but do I like things squishing into my fat making rolls everywhere no i don't like that so honestly this just feels the most comfortable to me right now and i feel like it looks way better than what i had on with the bra this looks more natural it almost looks like i'm not wearing anything on my boobs like this is how my boobs should look but they don't that's why i need the tape but it looks very very natural so so much better look at that oh i just prefer it i'm not trying to suffocate y'all with advertising this boob tape i'm just saying i'm just saying i love it that's why i keep talking about it because i love it so <sighs> i just love this boob tape i would show you guys how i have it taped but i don't know if i'm gonna get demonetized because the video that i made originally um showing the boob tape for the first time it got demonetized so or i think it had limited ads which is like so frustrating but that's why I can't really show y'all. But what I did this time was I put a small piece of tape and lifted it up. Small piece of tape, lifted it up. And then I put two bands across. And it's very, it feels very supportive, but also like natural. And thankfully this time I laid it nice and flat so you can't see all the wrinkles in the tape. Because the other day I did it like really messed up because I was in a rush. But you guys, I just love this tape. It's so good for summer. Okay, I'm going to stop talking about it now. But anyways, I do have a discount code. In the description box if you want to get you some tape but i'm just saying like if you have back fat and you've got rolls and your bras are always cutting into you and they're holding they're hurting your shoulders because it's weighing down like your boobs are weighing it down and making marks in your shoulders like on the real real on the real real please try this because i suffer from back pain and like i always get these like indentations in my shoulders for my bras and like this is just a savior so i just highly recommend to you if you have large boobies rolls and it hurts your back just try it out oh my gosh you guys my Shein package just got delivered I didn't think it was gonna be here this soon I was just telling you guys like in the last clip or the clip before that I don't know when it's coming because when I placed the order it said expected delivery date is June 24th and it's only June 4th right now and it got delivered. I I just have to say, like, I am so pleasantly surprised with you, Shein. Good job. Hit your girl up if you want to do some videos. If you want to collaborate, hit me up. But I'm so excited. Okay, so you guys, I got two bathing suits. I'm so nervous and so excited to try these on. Like I said before, these are for me to tan, for me to chill at my house. So if they're a little bit risque, it's okay. Um, cause I was trying to get things with minimal tan lines, but <sighs> with the kind of body I got, these are probably going to look very like, <gasps> hopefully I don't get demonetized, but I do want to try them on for you guys. So I'm super exciting. I've never ordered from Shein ever, ever before. That's why I just got a couple things. Cause I just kind of want to feel for it. I've never gotten clothes either. I literally only ordered three things because they had free shipping and I was like, let's just test it out. So these are the bra extenders. I got black ones and I got beige ones. I'll just show you really, really quick inside of the packaging because this isn't very exciting, but I am excited because hopefully my bras will just fit a little bit better. So there's one side of it. Where's the other one? There's a bigger one, which I like the bigger ones. Oh, what am I doing? Okay. Oh, wait. So the hooks are here. Oh, I get it. Okay. Okay. So if on my bra, which I actually have right here, so I'll kind of show you. Oh, and there's black ones too. They're the same thing, like a smaller one or a thicker one, depending on what kind of bras you have. I usually have the three clasp. So I think that's great that there was options. And you just hook it on to your existing hooks. And then 
Heck yeah, that's so awesome. Yay, okay, I really needed those. I think it was like $3 for that, and it's a six pack, so well worth it. Actually, let me, let me take it out and show you. I'm all over the place, I'm like so excited. This came in less than two weeks, you guys. That's actually really, really good. I'm very impressed with how soon it came here. So I got this hot pink one because, you know, hot pink looks so cute with a tan. And the reason why I thought this would go well with my body is because um, there's the ties, so you can adjust it to how big or how small you need. And this is just your typical like triangle bikini. Um, they're a little bit cheeky in the back, a little bit. I think it's so cute. Look at this color, you guys. I think the ties on the side are super cute and I like that it's very minimal tan lines. And I got the size extra large because extra large is supposed to be like a 12 to 14, I think. This is what I was worried about. The top is definitely gonna be too small. But it's it's hard because they, they came together. So I know the bottoms will probably fit, but the top already, it looks small. I don't know how this is an extra large, you guys. This definitely, <laughs> that's not an extra large. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, I'm worried about this. Okay, the other one I also got an extra large because I was worried, you guys, like because in, in other stores, I'm too small for plus size, but sometimes I'm too big for straight sizes. I'm like in the middle, so it's kind of frustrating. Um, and I had seen some reviews to like size down, so I just tried to listen to the reviews. So this one is really cute. This is also the size extra large. Both of these bikinis were $9 for the whole set. And uh, this is like that Dalmatian print that's gotten really popular. And I like the shape of this. It could kind of be like a high cut. You can put it up on your hips like that, which I wanted to try out. And the back is a little bit cheeky, but not too, too cheeky. So, you know, the bottoms look promising. Like the bottoms look like they'll definitely fit on both of them. And this one too, uh, this actually looks kind of promising. I was a little bit worried about this. I might be able to pull this off actually. And what I like about it is in the back, there is this crisscross so you can make it wider for your back. Um, so it's almost like customizable. So we're gonna try this on, but if it gets a little bit too, uh, to rate it R, I'm gonna have to cover myself, so give me a second. Okay, here's the first top. Keep in mind, I have boob tape on, so that's why it looks this good. I don't know what it's gonna look like without the boob tape. Uh, yeah, I underestimated how large my breasts is are, and this would not be acceptable to wear around people, that's for sure, and the bottoms are definitely too small i thought they would fit but they're too small i will say that the quality of these bathing suits they feel really good honestly for nine dollars the quality feels great and if i was like a dress size down this would probably be uh chill but i definitely messed up by not ordering from the plus size section so now i know and that's why i only ordered a little bit because i wanted to see you know am i from the do i wear plus size or do i not wear the plus size i don't know it's been so long since i bought a bathing suit you guys so this is definitely too small, look at this. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, like what? Look at all of this coming out. It's a really cute bathing suit though, like it really is cute. Um, it, it's just not fitting, girl. It's not gonna fit. It's, mm -mm. and I can't even show you the back because it is actually cheekier than I thought it was gonna be. I might just wear it just to tan and like just deal with it that it's a little bit too small but definitely the double xl probably would have been perfect because this is xl or like i guess if i do plus size i would be i think a 1xl i don't think i'd be a 2xl i i have to go look at the sizing because this is from the straight side which runs differently than the plus size so i think i'll probably make another order because I really do want some bathing suits that fit me nicely. I think the print is so cute though. I think it looks great with a tan, um, but it's just too small. All right, so I feel like these bottoms look way better. I haven't put the top on yet because I just know that it's gonna be too small for me. But I got this idea from, uh, I think her name is Brie Martinez. I love her channel. 
and she's a model, a plus size model. And she said, if you don't have enough coverage in the front, switch them around. With these kinds of bottoms, you can switch it around. So this is actually the back side, and I have the front side on the back. And it just gives you a little bit more FUPA coverage. But I actually don't mind these. I kind of like these. This kind of helps like the shape look better on my sides, on my personal body. And I wouldn't mind wearing these two together. And I forgot to mention that I really like this here because you can size it to your own body. So this is cute. I'm literally... <laughs> Size up, girls. Size up. I don't even know br what bra size I am right now. That's probably part of my issue. But honestly, this doesn't even look like a large. This looks like a medium. So, like, what the heck? This is not an extra large top. I don't know who thinks that they have extra large boobies with this triangle. I have boob tape on. Don't demonetize me. This is boob tape. I'm covered. Because <laughs> I don't want to take my boob tape off yet. But, like... This would not work. <laughs> this would not, this would not. This would, it would be really cute. It would be really cute. Like I can see it, I can envision it in my mind if it was the right size. It would work, but this, baby, no, 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 it's not. <laughs> oh my God, why do I embarrass myself like this, bro? But honestly, yeah, like if these triangles were like, this would be so cute and I would wear it in public. I would rock all of my, my rolls and my fupa and my curves and everything. But like, I'll have to try it without the boob tape, but I'm not going to do it right now. Like if anything, this would cover my nipples. <laughs> this is not an extra large okay the bottoms they fit great and i'll probably keep the bottoms um but yeah i'm gonna have to i'm gonna have to order some other ones 